Hey everyone, welcome back. So I just attacked uh, some of... These guys are rebels. I just attacked their villagers. Because I thought maybe I can take over this, uh, this city. But actually they're heavily defended. But as soon as I attacked the rebels, like afterwards, uh, Catalog decided that he's going to go and attack them. So, I was going to leave them, just uh, become enemies with them, try to get get into a war with uh, these guys. Uh, we'll just uh, raid the village, I guess. Hear me! Uh, holding a city like that would be very difficult anyways. So what are we up against here? Uh, not too much. Stay close. Infantry, forward. Form a shield wall. Bowman, move. Yeah, I think uh, my Bowman should be able to take care of these guys. I'll practice my archery as well. These guys are gonna not gonna play nice. Let's have my uh, cavalry go in. I think that's just about everyone. Yeah. Scatter people upgraded. If you enjoy this series, hit that like button. I'll, I'll really appreciate it. Let's me know if you want me to keep making videos on this. Yeah, so I've got a, I've got 80 troops, but I desperately have to uh, keep upgrading those. Get everyone ranked up. Yeah, I'm just going to uh, raid this for a bit and see if I can draw them out. 133. So they have... Uh, oh, that's that's a good mixture. Should if be an please. interesting battle. So we're very outnumbered here. I can leave the Batanian clan at any time. And I don't think there's any penalty for it. Follow me. I mean, I have a Off feeling the that Move. they would want to head over to me first. So forward. It's hard to know. Looks like uh, they're not really headed this way. So just get the infantry up here, and then for the infantry, Form a shield get them in a shield wall. Just takes them a while to, to get up there. Let's get my cavalry. Over there. Infantry. Forward. Just don't have enough infantry here, I guess. Forward. I think we're uh, we're killing a few of them there, so they should just uh, charge in soon. I 
I definitely don't want to rush this one and be reckless. Would hold everyone back, even the cavalry, for a bit. Okay, we've got the cavalry to charge in. To help take out the cavalry here. Well, I gotta get that guy. I got another one there. It's mainly just the cavalry I'm worried about here. This guy looks heavily armored. Nice. This guy. It looks like we've almost wiped them out, actually. Have everyone charge in. their calories wiped out potentially yeah we're just kind of finishing them off yeah, I think that was a tremendous battle we'll see what the results are in probably a minute okay so we still lost 12 but Look at all the renown and influence I got for that. It's definitely worth it. We'll take them prisoner. This would be a good way to thin out their forces. Let's get a ton of upgrades here. Okay, that's good. I mean, uh, prisoners. Wow, I keep getting those upgrades too. Oh, that's nice. So I'll go for that and I'll worry about the other upgrades later. So what is our army size now? Wow, I can increase it to 106. Did I just go up and a clan tier? I must have. Yeah, I'm clan tier too. Well, all right. I'll head back to town and we'll just get more troops and we'll head back here and do some fighting. Uh, we got so much loot for that. Over 17,000 and then ransoming the prisoners was uh, at least a few thousand. I forget what it was. Took forever just to sell all of that gear. So yeah, we're killing it with money now. I'd really love to just go and take over a castle. I have to head back and uh, just get a full party though. Yeah, we have 106 now, so I'm get a real army up and running. I need a lot more infantry and I think I can go down here. Yeah, we'll go to Ab Komar. 
not gonna chase those guys <laughs> too far. We can also level up uh, Meriwen the Wanderer. So I definitely want her to be, she's the scout. Let's just look at the clan here. Yeah. So we'll just put up, uh, what's your scout skill? So we'll put that up to four and we'll give her another focus point. So she can do, keep doing that. And then we get plus 29% travel speed when party morale is 75 or higher. Right now we're 72. But I definitely want the travel speed. So that'll be good for her. And I think that's it. Yeah, we're done with her. We got a full party now, so we'll just head out. So Batania is not at war with anyone else. So I'll just head back here and see if I... Did I level up again? Someone leveled up. Oh, the steward. Okay. Discarded weapons are donated to troop for increased experience. Uh, when the number of mounts is great, that's never going to happen. I guess to go for the top one. Hey, we got another attack here. Another uh, party we can attack. Uh, we're going to outnumber them, so it should be pretty easy. I think we can That's run them down. So this will be another fun battle. Under my orders. Yeah, so we'll just uh, go to the top of the hill here. Might have to chase these guys down. Not too sure. It is kind of annoying when they want to run away all the time. Let me just see. Yeah, they're just running away. So I'm just going to try to cut them off. Looks like they're turning around here. Yeah, they might have stopped. We're going to head over to this hill. I'll kind of go from behind. I'll go behind it so we get some cover. And we'll go to the top and start attacking them. Actually, we're not, because that's the edge of the map. Okay, we'll get out of the way. I'll let the footman run up, then we'll go into a shield wall. So we got a lot of rookies in here. Here they come. Let's send in in the cavalry. Want to take out this cavalry here? Oh, I got slowed down. Better get out of here. Get that guy. Oh, 
Let's have everyone advance. Oh, we're losing way too many there. I'm not sure what's going on. Oh, we should be a lot better than this. Okay, it's not too bad. Uh, 23 died, but 12 of them were volunteers. And the volunteers are just kind of throwaway. We're getting so much influence in right now, and that that'll help in the long run. So it's actually still very successful, in my opinion. Because not much of a shield wall when your volunteers have no shields. But uh, we'll go for... I'm, I might go for these guys now. Now we'll take all of those prisoners. So we'll ransom that guy. Yeah, some really great gear here. Let's just see if I can... Don't think I'll be using too much of it. Wow, 650. Guess I'll take the Lordly Shield. I'm gonna get so much money just from attacking these guys. So from here, I don't know if there's a closer area. I guess I'll head back to like uh, Pen Kanak. Uh, I don't really want to do this. Do the siege? I don't find that too much fun, especially if I'm not leading it. So I'm just gonna head back and ransom them and get some more troops. Yeah, we got twelve thousand for the troops. It was seventeen hundred for the ransom. Man, I gotta start buying some goods. I think. I'll probably just buy some food while I'm here. Just get that maxed out. Now they're just voting uh, who gets the, the conquered Legetta. So it's going to vote to see who gets that. I don't know how I... I think I you, you can like vote and stuff. I'm not sure how to do that. What? No. Oops, hit a wrong button there. I should get Legetta. I'm the one who kind of started that war. But ideally, if... Uh, so if I can find uh, a city or a castle that has, has rebelled, then that's going to be one of my targets. And especially now that, you know, I have a sizable army. Just got to get them ranked up. I'm going to try to find uh, an opportunistic uh, city to take. The cities, the towns are the best to take, the cities. Uh, you get the most money. But I don't see uh, anyone else here. It is problematic. If you if you take a city near the border, you just, you're probably going to be attacked soon. It would be ideal to like... Uh, take a castle back here. If the Vlandians were under attack and not doing too well. Because then you just have to worry about other Vlandian armies and then maybe Batanians in the future. So it's something to consider. I wouldn't mind going back there. But I'm just going to go and train up the troops and oh, go for the Wolfskins guy. Uh, that'd be an interesting battle. It's, pro it's probably going to get a lot of my troops killed. So I think I'm just going to... Actually, we'll train them up with some bandits. Okay, I'm just in card band, Seth, right now. And I noticed the uh, Noble Bow. This is a huge upgrade. It's extremely accurate, but it's 31,600. So I can sell a bit. And uh, I think I should buy that. <laughs> I'm going to do it. So I'll buy that and then I can give this 
the bow to Mary Wynn, uh, my hand-me-down. So I sold a few things. It's only going to cost 29000 basically. So, oh well, we just have to do a few more battles to get that. Yeah, so I'm just kind of traveling around. I've been fighting looters and I've, I've been upgrading my troops a fair bit. Yeah, so at this point of the game... <clears throat> wow, you know what? Uh, the Northern Empire looks kind of weak. I mean, they're way up here, but I wonder how many troops they have. Yeah, they're kind of... They're really cut off right there. I've been looking... I've been checking out the taverns and looking for someone with some engineering skill. But it'd be fun for a challenge just to take one of these castles. So I think the Northern Empire is a potential, actually. I'm just going to check the encyclopedia for the Wanderers. Yeah, so actually, I haven't found anyone who's good at engineering yet. So I'm just going to kind of search through city by city. There's nothing else to really do. Oh, well, it's the first time seeing this guy. Yeah, but I'll just go city by city, checking out, see if I can find those uh, wanderers and just do some, just hunt down some looters. But I'm thinking potentially the Northern Kingdom right there. That'd be a great castle just to get started. And we'll hunt down these looters as I come across them. Okay, I finally found someone decent at engineering. So I'm going to hire Vera the Accursed. Just talk to her. Well I've been traveling all over the place, Durgia, and now I'm in the Western Empire. Pretty far out, though. So let's take a look at what her skills are. So it's basically just engineering. So that'll help us out. And then, yeah, make go with uh, throwing and uh, maybe like a one-hander, I guess. And we'll give her a horse, of course. So I'll go to my party area and we'll make her the engineer. Okay, nothing's really happening. I'm losing like 900 a day just in wages. So I'm thinking if there's no war, I'm going to declare war on... Oh, did they take that castle? No, I might go for Flintock Castle, actually. Yeah, we're way out there. I think they'll have a hard time defending it. But I desperately need to be attacking armies. Oh, who are these guys? So I could go for them. I've been going after looters and being able to now, level up my troops. Come no closer. So uh, this, this should be some good money if, uh, if we do well. Okay, I'll just get everyone to follow me. Uh, they might be running away, I'm not too sure. But we definitely got the high ground. And the terrain seems to be in our favor. There's a little bit of a hill in front of us. Don't want to get too far ahead. If I can get to the... So I'll just slow down here. Looks like they're coming. Yeah, so we'll make our stand right here, I think. Infantry, move arrow, forward! Soldiers, forward! Let's get the cavalry over there. Infantry, shields up! Yeah, unfortunately, I don't have enough soldiers, really. Move Move. Okay, they're going to come in. Yeah, this... Uh, what are those guys doing? This bow is phenomenal. It's, uh, it's extremely accurate. Okay, I'll send my cavalry in there. 
Okay, I'm gonna try and break these guys down. Take this guy out. Come on. Oh, I just missed him. So I think everyone's doing fine out there. a good thrust. So I just one guy out there. Go help my uh, cavalry out. Okay, only last five troops there. That's pretty good. Really great renown and influence. We got 29 upgrades. We got a prisoner. So that, oh, I needed that. Wow, a lot of the, the archers did so well. I've got to get a whole lot more troops, though. Don't really have enough infantry to properly protect them. Oh, this is excellent, though. I'm sure I'll get some decent loot. I don't want to get too much cavalry. I want to get some more spearmen. Yeah, this looks really good. Nothing I can really use, I don't think. Ooh, that's a nice spear. Yeah, a lot of good loot there. So we'll just take that for now. I'll go back in, head back into Batania and... So where, where's the closest area? I guess it's probably Mar uh, Sionin. I'll head back there, fight any lures I can I can find, any bandits, and then well anyone of significant size. And we'll try to go for uh I do find going for like eleven's not too bad. I think like a lot of them are just like auto battle. But I get 265 gold. Get to upgrade some troops. It's not too bad. So we'll just head back to uh, Batania. Okay, I'm just going to leave the clan because they're not at war with anyone. And this is super risky. <laughs> but we'll just go and uh, raid their village. Get some goods. And then we'll be at war. Uh, this should be... Uh, Fairly easy battle. Yeah, I don't think they're going to get too far. Let's see if I can spread out the infantry. I'm not sure if I can. Do a little bit thinner. Just going to send the cavalry in. I think that's uh, is that it. I just get a lot of experience for that. It's just 10 troops. I need whatever I can get though. Let's get this done quickly. Okay, I'm sure we got a fair bit. Got some skill points. So hopefully they come at us. Okay, let's uh, stop the raiding and we'll just see what's up here. 
Because at least now we're at war. So they don't have a uh, 298. So I'm thinking we just start uh, reducing their numbers here. So then when I go to siege, it won't be as bad. It's what, what they have here, 46 down. infantry. Oh, this to be a great way to level up, really. <clears throat> I need to be at war at someone, with someone. On my orders. Oh, this is interesting terrain. They're quite close. This is, this is a really cool setup. Potter, move! Infantry, move! Forward! So what if I can uh, reach over there? I have no idea where that arrow is going. That was a lot closer to them. Yeah, we're kind of at a standstill here. They have got seven, they've got 14 cavalry, which isn't too great. I'm going to try to kind of charge in and see what I can do with them. If I can kind of lure them into the into fire, doesn't look like it. Ooh, I did a lot of damage to that horse. Let's see if I can get a few here. Get anyone there. This is crazy, they're not really even doing a whole lot of damage. So let's get everyone to go in there. Hopefully you can take out their cavalry first. So that the hill will give me a little bit of uh, protection for my troops. Okay, I better be careful here. Where's my infantry? Not charge him. Okay, it's a bit of a slow battle, but uh, overall we're winning. Shouldn't be too long from here. Okay, so we only lost uh, nine troops there. It's not too bad. It's gonna quickly go and take all these prisoners. And then we got a, wow, we got some really nice head armor there, 32. Oh, that's a huge upgrade. Yeah, that's really nice. So we'll take all their gear. I think I leveled up or someone did. Yeah, I got my leadership here. Okay, so as whether you're defending or attacking, I'm gonna be attacking a lot, so we'll get additional morale. So that looks good. And then someone else has an upgrade. 
Okay, Matara the Exile. Not personal. I guess it doesn't really matter. I think the dead aim, if we have our lead in a troop of arrows, of uh, archers, that'll be good. So everyone's leveled up. I'm just gonna, this is a great area. I can go and just get more recruits pretty fast. So we've got a full team. I'm just gonna go and siege this castle. It's my first time doing this in a very long time. So I think how this works is, we'll unpause it. I think you can put them into reserve so they don't get destroyed by uh, their catapults and things. I'm not sure which is the best one to make. Uh, unfortunately, the prisoner escaped. That's not a big deal. Just want to get this stuff built. Not sure how long it's going to take either. We're doing the siege camp first. So I think as soon as this is built, we move to reserve. I think that's how it works. So we have our battered ram, and then we'll get our honor guards. Because if not, if they're, if they're right there, then they'll just get attacked. So we have a catapult built. No armies have arrived yet. So we're going to do a trebuchet. And then hopefully when I lead the assault, then they will all be on my side. I'm not sure if that works. 